大家好，欢迎收睇精英专访。今集好高兴请嚟创科实业策略规划总裁，亦都系主席个仔 Stephen Putwell， 同大家讲下对公司前景嘅睇法。Hi Stephen。Hi, how are you？ 市场预期联储局咧最快喺今个月就会开始减少买债，咁担唔担心会打击到美国嘅楼市，继而影响到你哋嘅业务咧 ？I think it's one of these macroeconomic、uh, questions that we really don't have control over. And, and the aspects of our business that we do have control over, we're not going to change. We're going to continue on investing in new product. We're going to continue on investing in the right geographies. We're going to continue on investing in the right categories that we feel are areas that give us opportunity to expand into.、Um, you know what my viewpoint is? It's 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 kind of hard to say. I mean, you know, maybe they do, maybe they don't.、Um, does it have an effect? What I can tell you is that even when we went back in time over the past few years. When there have been bumps along the way, we've been able to outgrow the market and continue on taking market share. I don't think it's going to have a great effect. I don't. I don't think it's. I mean, like I said before, as long as we continue on investing in in the new product, I think we're going to continue on doing what we've been doing these past few years, and that's growing and taking market share. 公司上半年嘅營業額創新高，亦都達到咗雙位數嘅增幅啦。咁下半年又有冇信心維持到呢一個增長動力咧 ？I think we delivered an outstanding first half of the year, and from what we see so far, the momentum continues on to be strong as we go into the second half of the year. Now we obviously don't have any control over the macroeconomic environment, but the new product that we're launching to the market obviously is key for us driving our growth and、uh, taking market share gains. So we're on track. For the second half, and we feel comfortable, we're going to deliver our internal targets. Europe looks like it's 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 obviously、um, getting out of recession and starting to improve. The data in the U.S. in general has been quite positive. We don't want to depend on improvements of the economy. What we want to do is we want to challenge our people to grow by taking market share through developing innovative, exciting new product and go into new categories and help find ways that we can improve、uh, the performance of products. 除咗美國市場之外，上半年歐洲市場都做得唔錯噶。咁可唔可以都叫做係走出咗個低谷，而家步入緊一個增長期咧 ？Headlines are obviously pointing towards improvement in in the European economy. Our improvements in in the first half, or our strong performance in the first half of the year,、um, was largely because we were able to take market share. Our two strongest、uh, divisions in Europe in the first half were floor care. And our industrial tools division. So a lot of our growth was taking share. Now, if things really do get better and the economies get better in Europe, that's good news. That means we have more opportunity and we have more momentum behind us.、Um, so that's that's good. We feel very、uh, confident and we and we like the fact that the economy is is pointing in the right direction. But our market share in North America is higher than what it is in Europe, and there's a lot of room for us to continue on taking share in the. European markets.、Um, obviously, we have very aggressive goals, and we're going to try and capture as much share as possible. 公司上半年嘅人工成本啦，差唔多加咗成一成啊。咁内地工资加得咁快，对于公司嚟讲，会唔会都系一个压力咧 ？Staff costs actually went up less than uh, revenue, uh, number one. So there was leverage, and I think if you go back in time, in an environment when、um, commodity prices have increased. Remmen B has appreciated, and wages in China have appreciated. We've been able to continue on driving the profitability and the gross margins of the group. So, wage、um, wage increases in in China is not something which is new. This is something that's been been happening over the last few years. So it's something we've been able to deal with very well, and、uh, we've been able to increase the profitability of the group even in an environment when there has been pressures. 公司喺收購方面一向都好有眼光，咁之後會唔會再接再厲？喺今年之內會唔會有啲咩嘅收購計劃咧 ？We don't need acquisitions to grow. We can grow with the, brand, with the brands we have today. Acquisitions present themselves from time to time. If something interesting comes along, we look at it. If it makes sense, we consider whether or not it actually fits our portfolio, and then we contemplate whether we, we, we want to make this acquisition. We just bought Oric. Um, Oric is a floor care company, so、um, it's in the floor care segment of the market, but it's in the commercial segment of the market. So this complements our existing floor care business, which was predominantly retail. Stephen, you 零四年开始就加入公司，咁作为主席个仔，大家对你都有一定嘅期望。咁你自己又点睇自己将来嘅事业发展咧 
my expectations are very high, and I love being a part of TTI. I've, um, I'm, I'm actively involved in all areas of the business, and uh, my, my expectations are, are aligned with, with the other senior executives of the company. It's aligned with the shareholders, and that's to increase shareholder value. It's to drive innovation um, and really help take the company to the, ne to the next level. Thank you, Stefan. Thank you. It was a pleasure. 今集嘅精英專訪就嚟到呢度啦，多謝收睇。